Hi friends, welcome. Today as we see understanding the science, waste and recycling. Today disposing of our rubies is a huge problem, especially as the population of the world grows. There are more and more products we use only once, then throw away. Much of the rubies we produce contains dangerous chemicals and materials. A lot of rubies is disposed of by controlled tripping, also known as a sanitary landfill. Rubies is taken by trucks, tipped into holes in the grounds, then covered with layers of soil. When the hole is completely full, the site can be landscaped. This system has many problems, for example, poisonous chemicals may leak into the soil and also make their way into the water system. Another way to dispose of rubies is to burn into it in huge incinerators. In this way, energy can be produced to make electricity. However, this can also cause air pollution. Dangerous waste chemicals from industry are often placed in sealed drums and buried underground or at sea. Unfortunately, sometimes the drums corrode and the poisonous waste is released, polluting the land or water. Today, we are trying to recycle or reuse again many products that are often difficult to dispose of. These products include such as things as glass and paper. They are taken to recycling depots where they are crushed and treated and made into a new glass or a paper or the other products. Aluminium and steel cans are also recycled in the most countries. Some plastics can be recycled and some are biodegradable. This means that when they, lay, when they are buried, small organisms can digest parts of the plastic. However, some of the plastic remains behind and may take hundreds of years to break down naturally in the soil. Thanks for watching this video. If you like this video, like and share and subscribe.